Today we're going to be talking about how to use the LeadyB system as a way to achieve facility energy savings. We're also actually going to expand that a little bit and talk about some other issues with um, sustainability and looking at the building as, as a whole. When we look at, at buildings, there's often a lot of, of different things that people think about. One is, are we trying to be a green building? Are we trying to get a plaque? Um, and, and these things will drive how you think about the facility. Okay, I'm just needing to advance the slide there. Um, there's a lot of drivers and influence. The primary ones are going to be things like legislation and code requirements. AB 1103 is a good example. In California, there's an initiative um, out that it's in, that's encouraging commercial facilities to, to rate their buildings and provide those ratings for a commercial facility. Um, we have some legislation uh, being enacted in New York as well, and we're starting to see that spread across the country. Um, really requiring buildings to um, have performance goals and, and meet certain performance metrics. We also have code requirements. There's a lot of different states that have adopted energy codes, whether it be looking at ASHRAE 90.1 and, com and complying with that or complying with a state-specific code. Those are the kinds of things that, that make people change their behavior or enact um, certain initiatives. Another big one that's come up in probably the last five years is this, this idea of corporate social responsibility, corporations um, engaging in sustainable actions and, um, and promoting those things as, as they promote their business. Um, there's also the, the ever-present um, C-suite requirements. People in the, in the corporate suite, sometimes what we see in facility management is the CEO may say, we want to have a green building or we want um, our energy consumption to drop by 20% by the next year. So those are some challenges that facility management professionals face. Um, there's also a marketing advantage to sustainable buildings. So achieving something like a LEED certification can really positively promote the business. And there's also um, some, some bigger things like the Global Reporting Initiative that are out there. 